Look at number one. Find the value. You see absolute value sign. So let's clarify inside calculation. Minus minus becomes plus. So I have a fourteen dollar, but I owe six dollar. I give away six dollar, and after that I have eight dollar. So positive, yes, still positive. Okay. I owe fifteen a. I owe eight a. So I owe total twenty three a. But I have in my pocket three a. So give away three a. It decreases to twenty a. Minus twenty a. I owe minus twenty. Number two, distributing three times four, negative three times four, negative twelve y. Negative three times negative six, negative negative eighteen plus eighteen, and I have a minus eight y. A light term. This one, this one, gotta go stay together. Negative twelve y. Negative eight y plus eighteen. You know this is both negative. You owe twelve y. You owe eight y. You owe total twenty y. Number three, find the x value. I'm sorry, I forgot. Distributing fraction, one third. So one third times. 6y. Now, you're going to make a fraction, right? 1 times 6, 6. 1 times 3, 3y, three which is divided by 3, 1 divided by 3, 2. So it's a 2y. Uh, and 1 third, we have a minus sign, 1 third times 12 same way making fraction 1 times 12 12 1 times 3 3 after that divide by 3 4 divide by 3 1 which is 4 number 3 I made a little bit you know one more step distributing 2 times x negative 2 times x negative 2 x Negative 2 times 5, 2 times 5 is 10, but minus, 1 minus, right? Equals 6. Now it's a two-step equation. Jump, plus 10, 16. Pick this negative 2, this is a multiplication jump underneath, becomes division. 16 divided by 2 is 8, have a 1 negative, negative 8. Minus 4 plus 4. So I, I owe negative 10, but I have a 4. Give away 4, still owe money. Pick this one, jump upside down. Fraction 6 times 7, 42. Negative 1 times 2. 2, which is negative 21. Number 4. In the quadratic equation, if x is negative 3, what is c? You have a... This one, you can use calculator. Let me show you how to use it. This is a x, right? Square minus x plus c equals 0. The x is negative 3. So negative 3 times negative 3 equals 9. So it's a 9. Now negative negative becomes positive. So it's plus 3. Plus c equals 0. Now what is this one? 12 
plus c equals 0. Now 2 plus 1 makes 0, negative 12. And number 5. If x ordered pair 2, 1 and 3, 4 are two points on the graph of line, what is the slope of the line? This is the test question, number 4 and 5. You see slope formula. So you can say x1, y1 x2, y2. So you just plug in. So y2, you see here, right? 4. y1, you see here, right? So minus 1. x2, you see here, right? 3 minus x1 is here. This is a rate of change. 4 minus 1, 3. 3 minus 1, uh, 3 minus 2, 1, which is 3. What is the answer? A.